player, C player, D player, S player. All right. Oh, don't, oh, don't stand there, cuz. Don't stand there, cuz. I killed third bases, cuz. Let's go. Come on. I killed, I killed third bases. All right, so we got about roughly 15 to 20 cuts per uh, super flex, the normal flex. Ooh, that ball's shitty. See the webbing. Oh. Oh no. All right, switch. Here you go. All right, so this is the super flex. You think it feels soft? It does feel soft. Like okay. Get close enough. It's starting to web up a little bit. Let's we'll see if the sweet spot opens up. Hit him, Barry, okay? 
All right, I'm gonna do the, I'm gonna go with the super, super flex first. Maybe change it up a little bit. Um, as you can tell, when they're shagging, they stay in the infield for me. <laughs> Making it hit better. If I try to hit y'all, I hit good. Sounds good. I think it's opening up a little bit. All right. I'm gonna blow his ass up right here. Oh! Ow! Oh! Signature play, baby! That's all I had. That's all I had. Shortstop! Oh, he's like, oh, player, baby! Roughly put on about four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, anywhere from 140 to maybe what, 160 to 75 cuts, if that. So come on over here and let's uh, let's test them out and see where we're at. So we had two of them, the uh, Super Flex, we'll test that one first. So, all right, we're gonna go ahead and zero it out. You can see zero, let's pull it. So right around 240, 240-ish, a little over 240. All right. And then the not as flex, flex. See the zero. And let's pull it. So right about 260-ish. So as you can see, guys, the uh, they're definitely holding their compression. We've seen bats test way lower uh, with lower cuts. So 275 to down to 260. After 150 cuts, uh, time and time again, you see people wanting hot ass bats and uh, they break. So these are actually holding up pretty good. You see a little bit of webbing, not too much, but uh, I mean, you can't really tell. Kind of see the webbing there a little bit, but uh, overall, uh, we'll probably put some more cuts on it over time. Um, we'll see how it is. So we put about myself personally about 50 swings on this proton I, it's definitely not gonna be in my top 240 um, I like the feel the weight the half ounce end loads my go-to so I really like it uh, the barrels a little soft I can't tell if it's the paint or the actual barrel um, it did feel like it was opening up a little bit sweet spot getting a little bit bigger than when we first started I'd probably give it out of 10 maybe like a six I mean right now 240 Louisville is definitely my number one I mean, I would give it a shot. It's not not bad, it's not my favorite. I'm DJ. Uh, honestly, I mean, I would say, I'd give it probably a six, seven out of 10. I like that it held the compression pretty well. We probably put, you know, 150, and it only dropped, what, 15? That, I mean, that's good. And you always need that. Sweet spot was kind of hard to find. Uh, this is Barry here. I'm outfielder for Arsenal. We just won the Proton Series 1s. We have a, a Flex and a Super Flex. I definitely felt like the Super Flex wasn't as forgiving as the Flex. And the Flex hit the ball, I felt better. And it even tested higher than the Super Flex did. It's got a small sweet spot that I didn't didn't really like too much. And when you didn't hit the sweet spot, it always felt like you were hitting the end cap. But you may not have been hitting the end cap. But all in all, I'd probably give it about a five, maybe a six. I definitely like the Louisville's a lot better than these. What's going on, Rhino the Rep here? So we had the Series 1 Protons. We had the Flex handle and the Super Flex handle. Um, big shout out to uh, and thanks to uh, Charles Darling over at Proton for sending me these to hit. I'm not going to lie, they're really tough to hit, if that makes sense. Kind of a softer barrel than what I'm used to. Um, I prefer two-piece bats, but the one-piece was actually surprisingly uh, not as bad as I thought. However, um, one big plus for me is the compression. We tested it at 275 per bat, put about 150 cuts on it, and then all of a sudden we tested it after 150 cuts, it's like 250. So definitely your best bang for your buck when it comes to the compression. Everybody wants hot bats, everybody wants fire and gas, right? But they get upset when the bat breaks. So 
Uh, I think this is a very safe bet when it comes to holding compression. Um, smaller sweet spot than what I'm used to. I don't hit much, as you can tell in the video, like DJ said. They will hold their compression. So you can't really uh, argue about if it's gonna fail for Worlds or your World Tournament. If you uh, like the one piece feel, go ahead and try them out. Let me know if you wanna get in contact with Proton, but uh, Proton Series 1, we'll see, uh, we can do another video here shortly. Appreciate it.